Good morning, class. Today we're going to do our lesson okay. in art, and our theme is going to be called Colors Around the World. Okay. All right. But first of all, Miss Baker is going to read the instructions and give everyone a general idea about what we'll be doing today. Okay. All right. As I said, our colors around the world lesson plan will be uh, demonstrated as follows. Mm -hmm. It is for the early childhood education mm -hmm. level of mm -hmm. primary grades of pre-K through two years old, second grade age. Two to eight can be uh, easily, uh, can easily follow these directions yeah. to create whatever portrait they would like. Yeah. Okay, and the students will learn mixing colors around the world. They're, they will their objective is to have fun while experiencing the magic of color mixing. And there are only three main colors that make up all the colors in the world. And without them, there would be no colors. Right, children? Yeah. These colors are what colors? Red, Red. Yellow, yellow, and blue. blue. All right. And we call those colors the primary colors. And all other colors can be created by mixing the primary oh, colors goodness. in various combinations. For yeah, example, yellow and red makes orange. Yeah. Red plus blue makes violet. Blue plus yellow oh, makes goodness. green. And we call those colors the yeah. secondary colors. Yeah. All right. And, I, and our objective is to have fun while yeah. mixing colors, right? Yeah. Okay. So the materials that we would need today would be to have, we would have to have gift boxes. You can get them at the dollar store um, in bunches or just whatever type of box that you would like to use. Uh, but they're very ex inexpensive and there you get a whole pack for like a dollar. Okay, next we would need marbles. You know, you can find those any of the dollar stores and we have our paint our paint is yellow red and blue those are the colors we will be using today and next we would need our sheet of paper our sheet of paper white ordinary plain sheet of typing paper will be just fine or whatever type of paper you would like to use uh any color that you would like to look, use as long as it show up your uh, art and each student would receive a gift box and one sheet of paper and five marbles and then we'll add a spoonful of color of each color to the paper in, in the gift box and next the students can predict what color will result when yellow and blue are mixed and then the, they can predict what color uh, when you mix um, blue and red they can predict what colors when you predict uh they can predict whatever colors that you use uh okay. and then you can discuss oh with them what um color mixing is all about and they can even draw a color wheel right and here. you you could by using a large piece of paper in in front of the classroom on the chalkboard you can use a color wheel to help the children learn all about colors and finally you can let the children know that they can mix colors by using markers crayons paint or pencils and that's how they can learn about colors all around the world now we're going to read our book and then right before we get to our uh, demonstration now we're art class here and today the name of our book is Mouse Paint by Ellen Stone Walsh. Once there were three white mice on a white piece of paper. The cat couldn't find them. One day while the cat was asleep, the mice saw three jars of paint. What color are paint? What color are the paints in Red. the jars? Red? Red. And yellow? Yellow. And what color? Blue. Blue. Okay. okay. And they thought it was a, they thought it was mouse paint. 
So they climbed right in. Yeah. Then one red, one was yellow, and one was blue. They dripped puddles of paint onto the paper. The puddles looked like fun. They dripped a red, a yellow, and a blue one on the paper. Okay? The red mouse stepped into the yellow puddle and did a little dance. His feet stirred the yellow puddle until, look, he cried, red feet in yellow puddle makes orange. Okay, what color did the uh, red and yellow turn to? Orange. All right. The yellow mouse had hopped into a blue puddle. Yellow and blue mixed together. His feet mixed and stirred and stirred and mixed until, okay. Look down, said the red mouse and the blue mouse. Yellow feet in a blue puddle of puddle makes green. Yellow and red makes green. Okay. Then the blue mouse jumped into a red puddle. He splashed and mixed and danced until he turned purple. They all shouted, blue feet in a red puddle makes purple. Oh, good job. Okay, right? Okay, the mice okay, was mixing okay, the paint, okay, weren't they? Okay, okay. But the paint on their fur got sticky and still, so they washed themselves down to a nice, soft white. They washed all the paint off, and they were oh, white yeah, again. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, and oh, yeah, painted the paper yeah, instead. Oh, they yeah, painted oh, one yeah, part oh, red. Yeah. They painted one part yellow and one part blue. They mixed red, yellow to paint an orange part. All right. Yes, these were these these mice really was having fun painting. They were dancing and having fun, wasn't they? So yellow and blue to paint a green part. Uh, and blue and red to paint a purple part. Who likes purple? What's your favorite color? Blue. Blue? Yeah. All right. What's your favorite color? Well, we'll go with red. You got on a red shirt. But they left some white because of the cat. Now, the reason they left part of it white was because the cat couldn't see them. They were white. And the paper was white. So they left part of the paper white so that the cat couldn't find them. Because that old mean old cat might have them for lunch, right? Okay, so they didn't want to be eaten by that mice, did, by that big cat, did they? Yeah. No, poor little mice. Okay, so next we're going to get started with our demonstration. Okay. Okay, so we have our boxes gift boxes from the dollar stores you can use them over and over if you like uh wash the paint dries uh and not be messy right okay so we take one sheet of white type of paper and we place it in the boxes and then we we'll put the rest over here and then we'll take our mama's hello Hey, hello, hello. <laughs> Somebody's on candy camera. Okay, let's go with, okay, no, hello. Hello. Let's count, we'll, well, we'll count the marbles. Well, he gets a little more ready. Okay, so first we're gonna start off by dripping our paint. We need our spoon. Okay, one spot of blue. 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 Who, whose favorite color is blue? Green. All right. Green. Next, we're going to get our, what color is this? Green. What color, what color is this? Don't play red. Red. Don't so we're going to have fun playing with what colors? Blue, red, and what color? Yellow. Yellow. Very good. Very good. We got yellow. And we got yellow. And more yellow. Okay. 
Very good. Next, we're going to demonstrate by using our models, right? No, just made that sun. Oh, that looks like the sun. One big red spot. Yeah. Oh, good. Okay. Now, how many marbles do you need? Um, five. Five is good? Yeah. Okay, count. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five. five. And how many do you need? One, two, three, four, five. Good job. We got to know how many marbles we have, don't we? Yeah. Okay. And how many in this one? One. Two, three, four, five. Those marbles have real pretty colors in them too, don't they? Okay, now let's start out by shaking our marbles around and around. Take your box and shake your marbles. Shake your marbles all around so your colors get mixed. Shake them around. Good job. Look at everybody. Carefully. Don't, don't, don't go too fast where your marbles will jump out of your box. You just want to take them around and around in circles and up and down, horizontal lines and all types of lines in every direction, all the way around the world. Okay? We're going to have colors all the way around the world. Okay? All right. You got you to mix your colors. You got to mix your colors. You like to look at your colors, huh? Let's see. Let's see. Can we make your colors mix? Okay. There you go. Your marbles was stuck in the corner. Okay. Now, just mix your colors. Just like this. Look, look. Let's make our colors mix. Okay. Okay. You like yours like that? That's good. It's all good. That looks just like a real Picasso. What colors are there? What colors is in yours? What colors do you see? What colors do you see? Red? Oh, yellow. You see yellow. I see some purple. I see some green. I see. I see blue. What colors do you see? Uh, I see brown. Brown. You like brown. I see some brown too. Look like. The colors mixed and made brown and all the colors once they get mixed what are you doing having fun let me see yours really pretty are you having fun with these colors that's mixed around the world yeah are you do you have friends can you have friends all around the world okay that sounds Wonderful. I'm enjoying everybody that's enjoying themselves. These Picassos are really, really beautiful. Now, what do we do with them once they dry? We, we have to take them out and we have to hang them up and let them dry so that their parents can get a chance to see who all can make the wonderful, wonderful colors mix, right? Right. Okay, so after our paint dries, what are we gonna do with our, color, our, our colors? Yeah, I don't mix brown again. You don't like brown mixed? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Well, I think yours look really wonderful. It's a Picasso. No, it's not crossed, though. What is it? Um, it's like a star or something. <laughs> a star? Yes, it does have very sharp corners on some of the ends, right? Yeah. Let's get this out. Oh, we're getting it out. Once you keep mixing it and mixing it, it dries more and more, right? Yeah. Okay. You're going to mix yours more so that your your paint will run all over it. Right, right, right. All right, run, right, run, right, run, right, run, right. Run, the run, paint is run, running. Run, yeah. Okay, so who had fun? Uh, uh, who had fun? Me. Oh, the you time. Did? Yeah, the time we're ready. Oh, okay. 
Well, I guess we'll go on to our next project. This is the end of our lesson today. Yeah, and we hope you enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs>